morning guys, how are you today? This is our first morning waking up in Beijing. This one has slept, actually for hours and hours. Yesterday when we got to the hotel, he slept from like 12 till half past six, seven-ish. Then we went out for a little bit, he was still tired, so we went, just nipped to the shops. You saw this on yesterday's vlog if you watched. And um, then we got home, Stephen fell asleep I think about 11-ish. Woke up at half nine, so he's had like 18 hours sleep or something in the past. In the past 24 hours, but feeling alright now. 18? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we were walking around to the subway. One mistake I have made with this hotel is not checking how close the subway is to it. It's about half an hour walk, but never mind. We just found a little shortcut from the hotel to the station. It's a shame we didn't know about it yesterday when we had our big heavy bags with us. But never mind, we find it now. We are at the Summer Palace. Of, hang on, a GPS, I gotta go. We've come, our first little tourist thing that we're doing in Beijing, we've come to the Summer Palace. We don't really know what it is at the moment, we've just arrived. We've got some little audio guides. Whoa, steepest steps in the world, down to the river, Jesus. come down to the bit that you saw before, the river bit, look, here. I'm a bit scared that I'm going to fall in, though I'm not very, um... I put your hand around I'm not very good. I mean, the camera... Yeah, I will. It's a big little boat trip, look. This, this bit around the river is, is one way, and then... Hang on, uh, wheelchairs, I don't know. It's one way, and it's because it's quite narrow, and there's no, um, no barrier. <laughs> a man just walked past Stephen. <laughs> Pushing him up the way, he's just like, he's gonna push me in, he's gonna push me in. <laughs> that would have been funny. I think we're both a bit unfit. We just had to walk up about, it's only about 20 steps. Maybe, maybe it's a bit more than 20. We're knackered. I could have used that. <laughs> Oh, there's more steps. More steps. They're so steep. Aren't they? It's just So unbelievably steep. <laughs> the view's getting nicer, higher up we get. You okay? What's in there? Anything? <laughs> Timmy's knackered. <laughs> Aren't you? <laughs> that dude there is scaring the hell out of me. He's jumping across from, um, from like ledge to ledge in the drop. It's huge. Whoa, it's like little cave. Feel that way, which way we go? That way. I don't want to go down, that way. I don't want to go down, I want to go up. <laughs> Steven's a little bit confused right now. Do you know where that just happened? <laughs> we were just walking up and um, these people literally just grabbed us and wanted photos with us. It's Oh, is it talking? Oh, hang on, mine's not talking. Yeah. And then, um, I'm assuming it's because of the um, blonde hair and stuff. So we just have to have photos with all these Chinese people. <laughs> We're about to go into the Tower of Buddhist Incense. I didn't think maybe I would be allowed in with my shorts on, but no one said I can't. Oh, look at the lake. 
Oh, let me show you this view. This is nice. I don't think I can really show you for the... Oh, yeah. I can show you. Huh? Oh, no, I can't. I'll have to show you a peek through the trees. Can you see it through there or not? I can't really see on the camera, but it's really pretty. We just got to the top of Longevity Hill. That was quite a walk. But we are now at the Buddhist Incense Tower, which is just here. And apparently there's a hundred steps inside here that we've got to walk up, but... Yeah, there's like a Buddhist saying that if you conquer these steps and you'll live to be a hundred. So we'll live to be a hundred if we walk up them, so let's go. I'm not. I'm You're not walking up them? Are you staying down here? Yeah. I'm walking no, up. I'm Ignore as we're talking rubbish, you can't actually get inside it. Look. <laughs> this is just what's inside. It's a thousand hand Buddha. <laughs> Whoa, look at this! Wow! figured out where the hundred steps were it's these and then there's another tier up there as well that's the hundred steps isn't it wait is it just oh, okay. is it just up there one of them another one up there all of them these these are the hundred steps this little bit here those steps there and then those steps there and then that's where the tower is at the top Apparently, this is the longest corridor in the world. It goes on forever and ever and ever. Oh. Oh, no. Honestly, I don't think it shows on camera. But that is one hell of a steep hill to walk up. Stephen's given up. <laughs> He's given up. Do you know what's more annoying than walking to the top of a massive big hill? He's getting to the top of it and realising actually you've come the wrong way and you've got to go all the way back down a different way. So we're going down. We've got to go all the way back down there. We're just leaving the Summer Palace. That was quite nice, I liked it in there. We were going to go to the Old Summer Palace as well, which I think is about two miles that way. But we decided it's, what time is it now? It is quarter past two, because this one didn't wake up early enough this morning. We are going to, you should have, yeah, you only woke up because I was sort of started vlogging. Um, I think we're going to leave the Old Summer Palace and just head over to the Olympic Park where the stadium is. Does that sound the thing for you? Yeah, should we do that? Right, I don't know. Head back to the subway, head over to the Olympic Park. I am very good because the old summer palace looked quite nice to be honest, but it, was, it looked like it was all like gardens and things. And, but never mind. We can't do everything. Mm. Is it? I think we're getting the knack of this whole subway lark now, aren't we, Stephen? Yeah. We're quite good at it now, we know what we're doing. You may think that that wouldn't be a task, but trust me, for me, navigating myself around somewhere new is a, it's a big, is a massive chore. And I feel like I can do it now, I'm quite good. It's always empty, we're still in the subway trying to get out. Well, not trying. We know where we're going, of course. Oh, you can't whistle just... You can't whistle just like what? <laughs> what idiot can't whistle? <laughs> <laughs> Look 
We just got a lift in one of them. Dear visitors, welcome to the Olympic Park. Because we are committed to offering a pleasant and safe experience for all visitors, we'd like to ask you to receive security check at the entrance. Little, little, little oh, see him hopping, little frog. He's going away. We're at the stadium. He's gone. We're in the Olympic Park, there's the stadium. <gasps> oh, there is, there's loads of little frogs and things down here. Look at this, how cool is this? There's a dragon shaped water system. We're just down here where the frog was, was like there. And then there's a big dragon shaped water system around the um, around the stadium. You certainly can take a picture. Who it is? We're gonna go in, I think. Ticket office just there. Our tickets for the stadium. Wasn't the easiest thing, it never is, but hey, we got them. Are ready to go in? Let's go. I love coming to stadiums, I don't know why. Do you like coming to stadiums? Hey. Yeah. Look, we just spotted. I don't know whether we can get up there. It's like a little glass cube. We might try. I'll crap myself if we actually are allowed in there, but give it a whirl. We don't know how to get anywhere, we just walked around the stage. <laughs> Tried to get upstairs somewhere and we can't. We're back where we started. We're just wandering. I don't know how to get up. I want to get up to that top bit. Well, I don't want to really. And all the toilets are locked and we need a wee. Yay! It works! Good. Stephen's made up because he's found. A sitting down one, as opposed to one of these ones that he's had to use so far. <laughs> Stephen's complaining his legs are knackered, bless him, he has walked a very long way today. So we're just going to sit down for a little while. Oh my goodness, we've finally found some stairs that aren't gated off, we can get up. Oh, Stephen's not impressed at the amount of stairs. He said, I've had enough of stairs for one day. We really have walked up a lot of stairs today. Oh my goodness. And he's just fell over. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> We're getting a bit higher. That's a nice view. It's not good, my um, height scaredness is kicking in a bit now. I'm feeling a bit sick and weird. I don't like it. We're too high for my liking. Not that I'm going anywhere because there's like this massive wall blocking me. But I'm just a bit freaked out. I want to say something, but it just makes me on the next level now. Uh, yeah, I don't mind stadiums. I can do stadium height. It's... Oh no, this is the top. It's not. I mean, like, all the way there. Oh yeah. Yeah, see that didn't... Isn't it weird? I'm actually more scared to be... Like, the height in stadiums doesn't scare me. How? I don't know, it just doesn't. And it's because it's not a complete drop-off. It doesn't freak me out. But... It's just a complete drop off. That's scared. Does that scare you? A little bit. Hang on. Are you scared? <laughs> no, it's not that bad. Down there. We're going up to the very top. Right there. These ones are the highest in the stadium. We've decided that we're not going to try and find that. I wish you'd stop doing it. He's freaking me out like you won't believe leaning over things. Stop it. We've decided not to bother with that um, glass thing. I'm not going to flip and look. Freaks me out. 
I did have the edge to look. Wish I wasn't scared of heights, they're so am. We're gonna head out of that way where it's still the um it's still the Olympic Park. We're gonna see if we can get something to eat because we haven't really eaten since we've arrived at all. At all really, have we? Oh my god, I don't can know. What we sit behind you? At all what? We haven't really eaten anything at all, have we, since we arrived? Like a bit of fruit and stuff and some biscuits. We need to find some food. That's the aquatic centre over there. Look, this is the thing that I wanted to go and try and find and Stephen wouldn't find it. I, honestly, you said let's just go down. <laughs> Calm down. Honestly though, I don't really think I could have done that. It's just like remember a walkway. When, walkway on the top and then like that little glass said, thing. You said, There's no way I could have done that. Remember when you said let's just go down? Yeah, because you were moaning. Oh. Bang your head. <laughs> okay. Come on. This is pretty cool. It's like a massive big long wall all the way down with all of their um everyone's medals. So like we found Well yep, we found Rebecca Adlington. Stupid US. Stupid US, you can't say that. Oh yeah, and Joanne Jackson. Bronze medal, Great Britain. I wish it was three British ones. Oh that would have been good. Bronze, silver and gold. The start of the wall. And all the way down there. Where are you going? Oh, he's going over this way. We we're just about to leave, but it's just about to go dark and we want to see this. Oh, look, the lights have just come on, on it. We're so starving and we, we can't find any food anywhere. There's nowhere to get food around here at the moment. So we just went. We can't see it from here. We'll sit over this side. This one. Um. Yeah, so we're gonna wait for like five ten. What? Come on, we're gonna wait for like five ten minutes so we can see that little up, and then we're gonna go head back to like our local little bit and get some food from there. We're so flipping, so hungry. But it is dark. Ooh. It looks really light. It's quite dark. Isn't it? Hey! Finally! Home! I'm going to end it here guys. We have got back home and I'm just going to do a little bit of editing and I think Stephen's going to watch a movie. But thanks for watching today guys. We've had a brilliant first day, haven't we? Yeah. Yes. We're shattered though. I think I might actually just go to sleep. I might not bother doing any editing. I really could do with doing some, but I might just go to sleep early, wake up early, I think. Maybe do some in the morning before we go out. But thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you again tomorrow. Bye!